Hello, and welcome from your relocation team. We are so excited that you will be arriving in the US soon. We know this has been a long journey and you are almost here. This is a part one video of a two part video series. In this part, we'll be teaching you how to set up your Agencia profile so you can book your flight in part two. Before we begin, there are six things to remember while searching and booking your flight. Number one, use the travel regulations and information given to you by your relocation coordinator. This checklist will include your arrival airport, the dates approved for your arrival, and the deadline you will need your flight request for. Number two, please remember the following arrival deadlines. Please do not book your flight sooner than three weeks out as this allows us time to notify your employer and give them time to prepare for your arrival accordingly. They will also expect that you arrive no later than three and a half months from the date you received your visa and your facility confirmation. At your port of entry, you will need at least a three hour layover to ensure that you make it through US Customs and to your connecting flight. At any other layover, you will need at least an hour and a half to avoid any risks that may arise in the case of any flight delays. Number four, arrive during business hours or early evenings if at all possible. Number five, do not change your reservations once this has been approved. If so, your entire trip will be canceled. If you have any questions, please reach out. Your relocation team is here to help. Now let's set up your agency or profile. Agency allows you to search and find flights all at your convenience. As part of your contract, you will be allowed one international flight to the United States into your specified facility location. For the fastest and smoothest transition, we advise doing this as soon as possible. Once you have received your visa and facility confirmation, one of our onboarding and travel team members will reach out to give you travel information and requirements. Your agency login details will be sent to you in a separate email. The travel information and requirements that you will receive or have received will include the following. Information about your upcoming travel, such as the airport you need to arrive in, the date range approved for your arrival, current regulations, current world trends, and more information. Your relocation package information, such as what your employer is offering in terms of housing and reimbursements. Please note that this will be different per employer. Your arrival checklist. Ingentia instructions, and please note that all of this information will be coming from your assigned relocation coordinator who will be there to assist with all of your travel arrangements. You will receive an Agencia registration email. Here's what the email will look like. The date indicated is the day your account will become inactive. It is the day after your visa expiration date. Click on the link to register to your account. This will bring you to the registration page. Fill out the information identical to your visa and passport information. After filling out the information, you will see this page. Do not fill out the information again. Go back to your email for activation. You will receive an email with all of this information. Click on the link to set up your password. If for any reason you do not receive the activation email in order to create your password for the Agencia login, please visit the Agencia login page at agencia.com login and go through the forgot password link. Through here, you can use the email address that we use to activate your account and simply create a password that will suit you best. After this has been done, you can log in as normal. It will then take you to a page like this. After you have created your password, accept Agencia's policies. This will lead you to create your profile, double check your information, and upload your documents, including your passport and visa. This is needed to book your flight. You will want to fill out your preferences. Do not skip any of these slides. Click Finish to continue when done. After setting up your profile, this will take you to your flight booking page. Thanks for watching. Please watch part two for directions on how to book your flight.